while you're in the first five seconds of the video, go ahead, like, and subscribe. Let me show you this right here real quick. You know why we don't stick together? We've been destroyed in slavery, bro. When we came off them boats and chains, we wasn't throwing up GD or banging no trades or stuff, coming across our chest claiming black stone. We wasn't doing none of that. It was all stuff that was taught to us, and the next thing you know, they pushed drugs to us. And then you know what they did? They caused us to hate one another. What we trying to do is return that love that's back a, to our people. I feel like as the first people of God, God didn't come down and give us no pages. He's already inside. So looking at certain things we did come over here, we manifest Bro, stuff. Bro, stay in bill with us. Why you rushing away? Stay, because what we out here to do, go, but like because said, what you saying, you saying a lot of deep stuff but it's straying away from your true knowledge. This is your true knowledge. A lot of people think the white man wrote this book. The white man never wrote the Bible. The Bible is written by black men. Watch this, read. What's your name? What's your name? Eliel, come build with me, bruh, because we out here for you. Have you heard of Jonathan Majors? Okay, so Jonathan Majors was the guy in the Marvel movies. I, I forgot who he played, but he was a major character, right? So uh, he was dating a white girl. The white girl turned around and said that he hit her. This guy about to lose everything. His whole career, he was one of the top actors at the time. He was just in Creed Three. He about to lose everything. Have you noticed that that's a norm amongst our people? When a black man attach himself to the white woman, don't nothing good come from it. Because it was never supposed to be like that. Read. Ephraim is a cake, not perm. So I was trying to show the brother about the color of why our Puerto Rican, our Mexican brothers, are a little lighter. It was a prophecy that would happen. Read it again. Ephraim. He had mixed himself but I amongst show you the thing. people. Give me Deuteronomy 73 before you go, because I want to prove that to you in the Bible. What we are here to do is show you, you're an Israelite. You're not African American, you're not black, you're not colored, Negro, none of that. That's all confusion. And what's required of you as an Israelite is laws. This is one of those laws. Deuteronomy chapter 7, verse 3. Huh? Neither shall thou make marriages with them. So God says, you Israelites, you should make what? Marriages with them. You shouldn't make marriages with these other nations. Read. Thy daughter thou shalt not give unto his son. So he says, the daughter, and you got kids at all? So you not. I, I, I just want to say, you know what, what you got? Especially in our community, you know what I'm saying? For like you say, you know, it's not black. You use that term right now. Right. I look at the only issue with our people. Yeah, we don't stick together, you know what I'm saying? We, and you know what's so, 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 Let me show you this right here real quick. Other. You know why we don't stick together? We've been destroyed in slavery, bro. When we came off them boats and chains, we wasn't throwing up GD or banging no trades or stuff, coming across our chest claiming black stone. We wasn't doing none of that. It was all stuff that was taught to us, and the next thing you know, they pushed drugs to us. And then you know what they did? They caused us to hate one another. What we trying to do is return that love that's back a, to our people. I feel like that's the first people of God. God didn't come down and give us no pages. He's already inside. So looking at certain things we did come over here, we manifest Bro, stuff. Bro, stay in bill with us. Why you rushing away? Stay, because what we out here to do, go, but like because said, what you saying, you saying a lot of deep stuff, but it's straying away from your true knowledge. This is your true knowledge. A lot of people think the white man wrote this book. The white man never wrote the Bible. The Bible is written by black men. Watch this, read. Zephaniah. Chapter 2, verse 1. Because what you said is so heavy, you don't even realize it, bruh. It's a prophecy that God commands of us. Read. Hold on, watch this. Gather yourself together. So, so God is talking about the Israelite man. He says what? Gather yourself together. So God says, gather yourselves together. What you think about that? When God says for the blacks and Hispanics to gather together, what you think about that? Hey, this for you too. What you mean, y'all? You a part of this, ain't you? That's why I said we all should come together. We all should come together, right? And do what? You know, build each other, uplift each other, just like they say, you know, being around our, our people. Every time you say something, we take baby, we, we down each other. We, we down each other. We've been put down so much that it's hard to really look, look at each other and say, hey, man, well, I, you got a talent, you got a talent. We all going to lift each other up again. Hey, hey. Nation, what's the brother's name? No, keep talking, bro. Hey, Nation, Nation, what's the brother's name? Hey, bro, hey, bro. Come here real quick. Hey, so you talking about building. You see him as your brother? I do. You see him as your brother? Yeah. You see us as your brother? Yeah. Bro just said something heavy that what we need to do as a people, as a community, bro, we got to come back together. What I'm showing him is that what he just said is prophesied in the Bible. You know why? Because this book belongs to us. That's right. We ain't black. We ain't African-American. Before, 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 before I go, before huh? I go, we human. Before I we, go. No, it's big. It's more than that. I, I'm with you. What you say? Before I go, if I see you. And you, we got a common goal, whatever that may be. I can put it aside my differences and say, hey man, 
we're gonna come together and make this work. Whatever we got going on, we can make we we could expand that with any anything else that we do, right? Yeah. If I put my mind together with you, you might feel a different way. I might feel a different way. That don't mean I gotta sit here and hey, down the way you feel. But why are we not doing that though? Because if you look about it, we down each other. Each other down. I'm gonna show you why we not doing that. It's prophesied in the Bible. Hold on, hold on. So what's your name, bro? Antonio. Antonio, because you said something about us being human. Get, uh, my bad. Go to Deuteronomy 76. Because we are human, come feel with me. I want you to see this sign right here. Excuse me. When you look on this sign right here, what's your? if I was to ask you your race, who would you tell me? Black man, African American, mm. colored, Negro, real one, solid. Well, which one? I don't know my race. I'm black, but... What's your pop's race? So-called black man? You from Germany? Black man? From Germany? Yeah, 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 that's what's up though, bruh. So you be from the tribe of Judah. You know why he a black man from Germany? Because when you read the Bible, it's prophesied that we were going to slavery for sin. But what he was saying is something heavy, bruh. Check this out. The reason why we can't build as a community, because we don't understand the greatness of who we are. Because you said that we're human, but it's something special about you. Watch this. Deuteronomy chapter 7, verse 6. So this is the prophecy about the Israelites, the so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. Read. For thou art the holy people unto the Lord thy God. So God said, hold on, I will just let me finish this one scripture. So God says, you are a holy people. You know what it means to be holy? It means to be separate. We supposed to be separate from everyone else because we are on another level than everybody else. Why you think we the ones that excel in sports? If they want to get the best boxing match, guess who they going to get? A black and a Mexican. You know why? Because we built different. But we use these talents that we got to destroy each other down instead of fixing each other and building each other up. Bring it you know why? Because we've been separated from this. Hold on, watch this. The Lord thy God had chosen thee. No, who I chosen? Had chosen thee. The God that created heaven and earth did what? Chosen thee. He chose us. He chose the so-called black Hispanics. Read. To be a special people. Antoine, you're a special person, but you gotta come back to it, bro. Read it, read it from the top. For thou art the holy people unto the Lord thy God. So all we are here to do is to teach the so-called black, Hispanics, and Native Americans. You are a holy people unto the Lord thy God. God said that we are what? For thou art the holy people unto the Lord thy God. God says we are a holy people, read. The Lord thy God has chosen thee. No, God strayed away from us and left us. Chosen thee. God chose us because the world likes to think that we've been cursed and cast off. God never cast us off. We cast our father off. What we trying to do is get our people to return to him. Don't just stand and look. Come and build with your brothers. My brother, what's your name? Who? My name is Joe, Willie. So Willie, what we out here to do is we out here to try to return greatness back to our people. We out here to try to return that family by, back to our people. You an older brother, right? Let me ask you a question. Back in the day, you were born and raised in Chicago. Was it a point in time where you could leave your door open and not have to worry about nothing and let your kids play outside? You say what? Come over here, come close. Build with me, bro. You say what? It, you could leave your door open. Why is it not like that no more? You say what? Miscommunication? You think that we disconnected as a people? Jeremiah 17, uh, discontinued. You said we've been what? Miscommunication, right? Meaning what? It's a line of communication that ain't connected with us, right? We disconnected from each other. You know the, hey bro, hey, hey Sirach, what's bro name? Glenn, come deal with me for a second. My name's Joe. So we got bro Willie right here. And we, my name is Joe. You say your name, Glenn? Yeah, my so name. So what we out here to do is return greatness to you. So I asked bro a question. He yes, said back time. in the day, you used to be able to leave your door open, let the kids play outside. You can't do that no more. You know why? Because you got babies catching straight bullets, bro. And we think that this is normal. Think of how crazy that is. Our babies ain't dying because of health diseases and stuff like that. We got babies dying from gunshots and everybody rides by living their life like everything is cool and don't nobody care. Nobody care. What we out here to do is to try to get that love back amongst us. Something got to change. You know what got to change? We got to change. We got to change as a people. Nation is family. Nation is community. Nation is men leading by example. Nation is women's support. Nation is children with role models. 